What are real lightsaber blades made out of? So according to Star Wars canon, a lightsaber blade is a brilliant blade comprised of plasma. The plasma blade is generally about three feet long and it extends out of the emitter section when the lightsaber is activated and then it recedes when the lightsaber is deactivated. In Star Wars, lightsaber blades may be used, well, for many different purposes. They may be used to deflect blaster bolts, absorb force lightning, duel with other lightsabers, and cut through almost anything. Although there are a few lightsaber resistant materials and weapons out there as well, you know, like cortosis, Mandalorian iron, a few other items too. But for the most part, lightsabers can cut through a lot of different things. So they are quite versatile. They are quite handy. I guess that's why the Jedi and Sith really like to use them. Now, lightsaber blades may come in many different colors, but uh, you know, like here's yellow, but you know, still blue, green, and red are three of the most common colors. So that's a real lightsaber in terms of Star Wars canon. Now, are lightsabers blades real, as in like real in our real life? So lightsaber blades made of plasma are not real and they do not exist in real life. So if we did have those, they'd be super dangerous. I don't think I'd want to be near one or yeah, not without proper safety equipment. I think I still wouldn't want to be near one. But, you know, there is a YouTuber out there that's created a real lightsaber. It's not with a plasma blade, but it's super hot and it cuts through things. That YouTuber is called Hacksmith. And so, um, yeah, he created this real lightsaber with a titanium blade with a ceramic insulated tungsten core. So that's maybe one of the closer real lightsabers we have all out there. But it's, you know, incredibly dangerous and it takes a lot of batteries. It's more of a proto saber um, type of thing with an external battery pack. So feel free to check out that real lightsaber, real life lightsaber, uh, if you'd like to. That's probably enough air quotes for this video, right? All right, how about lightsaber blade effects in Star Wars movies? So I know that some people to this day think that in the Star Wars movies, the lightsaber blades are real, but you know, they're, they're all enhanced, okay? So if we go back to the 70s and the 80s, the filmmakers used a technique called rotoscoping where they basically kind of trace over, um, you know, frame by frame in the film to create the lightsaber blade effect. That's what they used in those days. Nowadays, they use, you know, kind of CGI to uh, make the lightsaber blades, but that's basically how we get lightsaber blades in the movies. Um, now, how about real life? So the real life lightsaber blades that we do have are for the most part plastic, okay? The vast majority of uh, lightsaber toys and also, you know, custom sabers, force effects lightsabers, all of those things uh, use some type of plastic blades. Now the plastic blade can vary a bit. Here's one right here. Obviously I'm not burning my hands or anything. This is a plastic blade. It's quite strong. A lot of the custom sabers will use a polycarbonate blade and sometimes for kind of flat, more decorative blades, um, it'll be made of acrylic, which is a bit more brittle. But those are really two of the kind of most common types of real lightsaber blades. Um, you know, they're both plastic. Uh, yeah, our real life lightsaber blades are plastic. We don't have plasma ones. So um, that's about it for lightsaber blades. What do you think about lightsaber blades? Do you have, um, you know, any custom lightsabers, any force effects lightsabers? Feel free to comment below.